Hello guys, welcome back to another vlog. I haven't vlogged in quite a while, so um, I felt like doing it today because we are gonna go on a winter trail ride today. Um, God, I just put out a round bills this morning and everybody's fighting over this one. Hazel and BB and Oakley. I don't know what BB's deal is. She has to eat whatever Hazel is eating all the time. She's gotta be right in that spot, even though there's a whole round bale, she's gotta eat whatever Hazel has her mouth on. And Hazel threatens to kick her butt every single time. And she just keeps going back for more. So I don't feel bad for her. But before we go riding this afternoon, I have a lesson this morning, which should be here in the next like 10 minutes or so. So I have Sugar out um, waiting for her lesson and I've already got the truck hooked up to the trailer over there. So when we're done with the lesson, I plan to just throw her in the trailer and I'm gonna take her riding. Um, so yeah, it's pretty nice today. It's a little windy, but not terrible. So I think we'll have a decent ride, but it's nice and warm today. So um, I have a friend that's coming up this way to go to one of the parks to go riding and so she invited me and I was like yeah um because everyone needs ridden and yeah might as well take advantage of the nice day um yesterday I don't know some of you guys maybe watch my other channel um I post just some random videos on there but this summer I started posting my furniture flip videos over on my other channel which is always linked down below if you're interested. But I started flipping furniture this summer and posting like my before and after pictures on that channel. And so um, yesterday I went a little crazy because there was an estate sale and I found some curb alerts. So I picked up seven pieces of furniture yesterday in my friend's car. I was like trying to shove it all in her Acadia and um, I managed to get it all, or not all seven, I was actually at the estate sale and there was this bedroom set, a dresser, two end tables and a bed frame, all a matching set for $10. They wanted $10 for the whole thing. I was like, I don't even care if it's broken, if it's scratched, it's 10 bucks, just I'm gonna buy it. So, so I bought it and um, my grandparents happened to be at the estate sale at the same time I was and um, they got conned into helping me move it all. So yeah, I bought a bunch of stuff and then I have this place full of a bunch of stuff that I bought too. So, or I didn't buy it, it was all free. So yeah, if you're interested in the furniture flips, go over to my other channel and um, check those out. I'll have more coming soon, obviously. But yeah, otherwise I'm gonna just wait for my lesson to get here so they can ride sugar around for a little bit and then we will be going to the park. All right, so my lesson just ended up canceling that um, apparently they had church this morning and you know, I kind of forget that people go to church uh, because I'm not religious. I've never been a church goer. So on Sundays, I kind of totally forget about that. So I need to, keep that in mind more often when I try to schedule lessons on Sundays. Cause a lot of people just want to do it on Sundays. I don't know why they have plans on Saturdays. Um, but I kind of just, I totally forget about that. So their church, I guess, ran late and they won't be here for another half an hour or so. And I'm like, Ugh, I already told my friend I'd meet her at noon. So we're just going to do next weekend. But, um, anywho, the girls are like running around or they were because like, here they go again. The, um, I don't know if you guys can tell the round bale is like getting wind under it. And like one of the layers is starting to flap and I think it's spooking them. Kind of funny, but, um, anyway, I don't know. I guess I'll just leave sugar tied up here for a little bit. And before I go and I'll just load up the truck. All right, guys, I've got my little winter riding boots on. If I can get my pants up. I don't ever like wear these, but I don't get rid of them, obviously. 
I don't know what brand they are. The tag says HKM Sports Equipment. And like, they're not the worst winter riding boots I've ever had, but they're not the best either. And I have leggings on. So if it gets too hot, I can take these sweatpants off. But I wanted to wear two layers just because it is a little bit windy today. So I don't know if it's going to be cold out there or not. Um, but yeah, I hardly ever wear them. I've had them for quite a few years now. And I think I've worn them only a handful of times just because I don't really ever ride in the wintertime. Um, so I do know that my feet will eventually get cold. But they're a lot better than riding in just regular boots. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and load up sugar now because I need to stop at the gas station before we go. And, um, hopefully she's not an asshat because I haven't been anywhere in a while. Just taking a snack for the trailer ride. <laughs> oh, did I lose it? You lost it. Come in. Good girl. Over there. Good girl. Good job. It's a good horse. Okay. All right. We're in. I think I got everything I need. I'm not bringing very much. Just my tack. Because um, this park is pretty close to my house. So it's not like I'm going on a road trip. But, uh, I think that's all I need. So, I'm gonna fire up the truck so we can go get fuel and be on the road. All right, I just got to the park. Um, my friend Brooke is not here yet, but she said she'd be here like right around noon. It's like 11.55, so I'm sure she'll be here any minute. Um, I stopped and got gas and I wanted to put a little bit of air in my rear truck tire because like it leaks a little air and it looked a little bit low. So I was like, oh, I just better put some air in it. So I like pull around and there's somebody already at the air compressor with a truck and trailer, right? I kid you not, this guy. I don't know if he didn't know how to air up his truck tires or like if the pump wasn't working or... Oh my God, he was there for so freaking long. I swear he had to have been there at least 20 minutes because he was backing up, up to it as I started to pump gas and it wouldn't work. So I had to go in and prepay. I finish pumping gas. I pull around to wait for him to be done at the air pump. And he is there for so long. I was like, oh my God. I swear I waited there for 15 minutes and he was still like holding it up to his truck tire and then he'd go back around maybe it was timing out because i know like the it'll only stay on for so long so i'm guessing he had to go like hit the button again i just left <laughs> i was like oh my god dude so i just pulled around past him and left and i think he looked at me and like i kind of felt bad like maybe he doesn't know how to do it but i was like oh my gosh like I'm going to be here all day. So I didn't put any air in my tire and hopefully it's okay. But I'm just waiting for Brooke to get here now. Sugar's um, moving around in the trailer back there. But I think I might run up to the bathroom quick while I'm waiting. But yeah, I'll um, be back.
gosh, eggs. <laughs> Slowest horse known to man. Assuming our position in the back. No, we're not going in here. Sands a workout, isn't it? Look, guys. Look at that. I have some rocks in my pocket, too. Super cool. All right, guys, I apparently never ended off this vlog, so I'm going to go ahead and do that now. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. I know it was pretty short and sweet, but I feel like I just should vlog because we don't get to go on winter trail rides very often. And today proves that because we're getting like five inches of snow today. So I wanted to take the opportunity while it was there. But Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Before you go, make sure you check out the description box below where you can find all my other social medias, my buy me a coffee, etc. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.